people of God. When you say nay, it talks a lot to us. Amen? We are all parents here. When our wives are pregnant, we search for the names. Why? Why you give so much of prominence to the name? Hey, you can, you can name anything. No, 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 pastor. No, 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 uncle. No, 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 this, no, no, no. I want to give a name. You know what does it mean when they want to give a good name? It's not the name that sounds good. It sounds the meaning. Amen. Hallelujah. Name, you got to be very careful. Name, it carries a power. Name, you got to understand. That's the reason we search the names and see the best of the meanings as the Lord leads us, we name our children. Amen? What does a name stand for? There are three things name can speak to us. That's why it's very important for a parent to explain and to make the children understand the name that you're given unto them. Because when we give the name to the uh, our children, we have certain ideology, or we have certain intentions, or intuition that our child should be like this. Am I right? That's the reason we name them. We name Elijah. We name Elisha. We name John. We name Paul. We name all the Bible names because it carries such a name. My daughter's name is Elisha. Nobody knows probably. Elisha means the feminine of uh, uh, Elijah, the double portion of the Almighty. Even till this day, I tell her what's the name meaning. It's not that she forgotten or she doesn't know that, but I keep repeating every time and every day I pray, Lord, let the double portion of the anointing as we named uh, Elisha may fall on her. That is my prayer even till this day from the day she's born. Amen. That's what we got to do that. Name has got power. Name has got efficacy. Name has got certain empowerment into your life. When the children hear the meaning of the name, meaning, meaning, meaning of the name, there's something automatically descends into their life that, hey, my name is something I cannot go against you. Do anything according to the name. Amen? I have to live up to the name. I have to move up to the name. I have to do up to the name. Because that name is very precious to me. The meaning of the name is so powerful that my life should live according to the name that is given unto me. Amen? That's what Yeshua. That's what Jesus. Jesus' name is given by angels. Jesus' name. He got to save everybody. Jesus knew the meaning of the name. What is comfort? What is doing? That's the reason till the last breath in his life, till the last drop of his blood, he knew the meaning of the name. I got to save the generations that are going to come, that are generations that have passed by. The name of Jesus only can save. So I have to be a sacrifice on the cross and the altar. Because Jesus knew the meaning of his name. Amen. He saves. Through his death, people will be saved. You know that he has to die. If he doesn't die, he can't save the mankind. In Jesus' name. 